Some of the biggest advice that I give my parents when I train them and teach them and have workshops and conferences, one of the things I say is from zero to 10, teach, talk, and train, and from 11 to 18, listen, learn, and love. What does that mean? Hi, everybody, and welcome to Tuesdays with Tillman. This is the day that the Lord has made, and we shall rejoice and be glad in it. Today, I want to talk to you about some of the biggest advice that I give my parents when I train them and teach them and have workshops and conferences. One of the things I say is from zero to 10, teach, talk, and train, and from 11 to 18, listen, learn, and love. What does that mean? So when we have children and they are very young, it is very important for us to teach them what is right and what is wrong because there are things in the world that are right and wrong. If I say hi to you, you should be able to say hi back, right? That's good manners. If you hurt somebody, you should be able to say, I'm sorry, right? Just right and wrong. So it's very, I guess, simple, um, but also very hard because oftentimes we're not intentional about doing it. So let's really try to teach our children between right and wrong from zero to 10. Next thing is to talk to our children. When they're very young, oftentimes they'll say, eh, you know, like, what do you want? You'll know they want the bottle, but they'll say, eh, and they'll be having their hands up like this. Instead of you giving them the bottle or giving them whatever they want, give them the words. Say, oh, I see you want the bottle. Oh, Jamie wants the bottle. Jamie wants the toy. Give them the words, even as young, before they start talking. Give them the words so that when they do start talking, they already have the words inside of them. And then three, I said what? Teach, talk, and train. Train your children to be self-reliant. Train them to do the things that they already know how to do. You've heard me say this before. We're not raising children, we're raising adults. And so when they get old enough, and they know how to what? Take out the garbage, have them take out the garbage. When they get old enough and they know how to do certain chores, have them do the certain chores, even putting on their own coat. I have four-year-olds that I know know how to put on their coat, but as soon as their parents come in, the parents are putting on the coat. Listen, self-reliant skills are so important to teach our children, to train our children with, because why? Because they get a sense of self-confidence. They can do it for themselves. When we are able to do that, put those things in place, children will be better off in the future. So those are the things I want you to teach them, right? Teach, talk, and train from zero to 10. Then from 11 to 15, I want you to listen to them more because that's the time when they're going through puberty and they're you know, feeling insecure. And you just really, you heard me talk about listening before. Put on both of your ears and actually listen to your children, okay? Listen, learn them all over again because they are changing every single day. They are growing, they're developing, and I want you to learn them all over again. And then finally, to love them unconditionally. I know we say we love our children over and over again. You have to figure out what your child's love language is. Is it acts of service? Is it words of affirmation? What is it? And then give them what they need. This is a very difficult time going through 11 to 18 years old. And I really want you to stay intentional about listening, learning, and loving them unconditionally, always, no matter what. I know this is going to help you. Teach, talk, and train. Listen, learn, and love. Until next time, I'm sending you love, peace, and a lot of hope. Bye-bye.